Asking your grandparents what time it is as a kid. Hey, part tip, a quarter until two. What? I hate when hey, people do tip, that. Redact, 45 past one. Like, dude, literally, what is so hard about saying 145? Why do you have to say, oh, quarter till two, 45 past one? You make it so freaking complicated. They do it on purpose to make you look dumb. That is one thing I hate about old people, <laughs> amongst other reasons. And someone way, like to explain to me why my cheeks would itch like, uh, you know, when I wore leggings to school and had to sit at a desk. I thought that was just me. Are you kidding me? Well, hold on, hold on, hold on on that. Hold on, hold, hold on. Girls, comment below. Has that happened to you? That would happen to me whenever I would try running, you know, jogging for exercise. It was stupid. I hated it. I'm not a runner, but my thighs and cheeks would itch like crazy. Literally, I would be like in my leggings just scratching like, is it the fabric or something? Someone please tell me. I thought I was just crazy and out of shape. I mean, I am, but. Old people when their phone is ringing in public. Answer it. That literally always happens. Their phone is on full volume and then they take like a whole 30 seconds to answer it. Like, who is this? Answer it and find out. That happens to me all the time. Like we were eating at a restaurant not too long ago and the person at the table next to us had their phone constantly ringing and they wouldn't answer it. Put it on silent. That's an idea. Committed Being a housewife is what I want. Okay. That is where my Lord Marry is rich, now. cook and clean that for my partner. My Enjoy a life of leisure. Oh, um. Okay. I hate when TikToks go too fast and I can't read it. Enjoy a life of leisure time and spending their money. <laughs> Yeah, spending their money. That's the key. Not the what about feminism? Don't bring, the boys into don't bring my morals into this. <laughs> That's not what it's about. All right. Okay. Woman, you what about being a physician assistant like you've dreamed of? I refuse to, I refuse to work a nine to five for the rest of my life just because I wasn't born a trust fund baby. So true. Be blamed any longer for this grotesque misalign. Okay, seriously? All of us dream of having a life where we're rich, things are easy, we can buy and do whatever we want without actually having to work. So why do you judge people when they finally get that? <laughs> Seriously, they're living the dream. Why are you mad just because it's not happening to you? Okay, don't be mad at them. Do something about it. <laughs> Let's normalize not telling men thank you after they say, you're pretty. You're welcome. You're, you're welcome. And bless on to you. <laughs> Thank you for what? The I got a mirror. Mirror. Thanks. Stay up. I love her energy. She passes the vibe check. I want to be besties. What's your number, girl? <laughs> That's so true. It's just like, okay, you're welcome. Do something about it or walk away. I'm gonna reject you either way. <laughs> Less on to you. <laughs> That's my new favorite quote. One time when I was in eighth grade, I got a hickey on my neck because I had daddy issues love and that teacher notice and sent me to the principal's office Ooh. and the principal was like i'm calling your mom really and I was like i burned my neck with a curling iron on accident and she was like no you didn't so on the bus ride home luckily my best friend and i shared the same bus stop and i asked her if i could go to her house really quick to burn my neck with her curling iron and she said yes besties so when i walked into the house my mom was literally ready to beat me i was <laughs> like mom look it's just a curling iron burn and she was like, wait, yeah, that's clearly just a curling iron burn. And she got so mad and she called the principal and she demanded that she apologize to me. And the principal had to apologize to me. And to this day, my mom still doesn't know. Well, she does now because I'm telling on you. <laughs> but seriously, girls, whatever age you are, if you're in middle school, high school, whatever, if you get a hickey, Every grown woman is gonna know you lying when you say it's a curling iron burn because there's such a big difference and we have all used that excuse. <laughs> there was one time I did get a hickey. It was like in high school, maybe sophomore, junior year. I didn't know I had one. I just woke up the next morning, walked to the bathroom, walked back to my room and then my mom came in and she was like, cover that up before your father sees. I swear to God, <laughs> it was so scary. <laughs> I was like, oh my God, I can't believe I didn't notice. <laughs> It was my first hickey ever. I didn't know they existed. <laughs> what is your toxic gamer trait? 
I'm a looter. I loot everything. Me too. If it's there, I'm looking at it. I'm looking at I'm it. Grab it. I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna examine it. Examine it. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm stuck behind. So you like, hey, gang, where you at? Look, I, I gotta check it out. I gotta check it out, girl. <laughs> Seriously, you find some really good stuff. And you're always the richest player and people wonder how you do it. I loot, girl. <laughs> Literally, your whole team is dying. And they're like, girl, Sarah, where are you at? Come through. And I'm just like, bruh, I'm still two fights behind looting everybody. You gotta give me a minute. <laughs> I'm the one that always buys us the pretty new guns. Where do you think that money comes from? Back off. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't rush me. <laughs> Yeah, I just got through the storyline in uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. Great game, by the way, amazing graphics. And I am still looting. I loot everything. Even though I'm, you know, John Marston, I'm rich. I have like $20,000, I still loot. It's fun. <laughs> Me telling myself I can work so I can afford my shopping addiction. Me. <laughs> the boss always asks, okay, so do you wanna stay late? Do you wanna come in early? You want some overtime? Girl, no. I said I wanna work so I have money doesn't mean I'm gonna do it. <laughs> There's a distinct difference. <laughs> Teacher handing out test. Smart kid. Oh, snap. And then the rest of the class is like, oh man, we're screwed. <laughs> Even the smart kid is like, dang it, I didn't study hard enough for this. And you know he studies all night, every night. That's why he's so freaking smart. So, you all about to fail. <laughs> oh, look at the kitten. He's making biscuits and sucking on the sock. I can't play the music for you because of copyright stuff, but it's so cute. Oh, they're playing Soft Kitty, Warm Kitty from Big Bang Theory. Dude, that's the cutest freaking kitten in the world. It's snuggling, it's comfy. Put on a movie and get it some snacks. When you stop folding your clean laundry, you only shower when your hair looks greasy, you leave everyone undelivered, and nothing sounds good for dinner. Wait, what's the problem? Is something wrong with that? I literally do that all the time. I have a pile of laundry right behind the camera. <laughs> and two, you're not supposed to wash your hair every day. It's actually bad for it and dries it out. You should only wash it when it's really greasy. <laughs> I leave people undelivered because I'm lazy and I don't know what to say yet. And sometimes you just don't know what you're craving. Wait, what's the... Okay, TikTok stretches a little bit. They make me think everything I do means I'm depressed and anxious. I know I'm not depressed. I might be a little anxious sometimes, but not like, you know, clinically. You know what I'm saying? Stop making me think I'm diagnosed with everything in the book. <laughs> I'm What's up? This is going to be a new series that so I uh, am uh, going to call How Long Until They Put the Block of Cream Cheese in Their Crock Pot. Dude, that is so true. White people, don't try to lie. Don't deny it. Every single recipe, especially, you know, white people with casseroles, there's always an entire block of cream cheese. I don't know what it does to it, what the flavor is. I don't know. I don't cook casseroles anymore. <laughs> How long are you going to take her? What is she doing with that bottle? There it is. <laughs> that did not take long at all. Not even halfway through the recipe. I don't even know what she making, but I don't want it. All she did was put salt and pepper on that thing. <laughs> How about some paprika? <laughs> Watch till the end. <gasps> oh my God, there's two Michael Myers on the street. And they're just standing there doing nothing. What's gonna happen? That what you doing? Too funny. They're not moving. It's a uh -oh. game of chicken. Uh -oh. oh no. Uh oh. What's he gonna do? You about to fight? They're gonna <laughs> hug. They're gonna hug it out. Bet. They're gonna hug. Do it. Do it. They're probably talking do to it. each other. Like, like, what are we gonna do now? What do we do now? <laughs> what do we do now, man? How do we make this better? Hugs! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> that is my favorite thing of this whole year just wrapped up. That is what I needed. As I walk through the valley of the shadow of the death, <laughs> I will fear no evil. Ah, I'll feel that. I'll Run. Feel that. I'll fear that for sure. Mm-hmm. Dude, you're doing exactly what you're not supposed to do. As I... You are every white person in every scary movie. That's the game Little Nightmares. I watched Corey Kinshin play it on YouTube. It looks really interesting, but I can never play it. I hate being scared. 
It's a really good game though, you should try it. You know what I what I don't really understand? When I tell people That's a lot of product. I'm not doing a face. Why they think that that means I'm not putting on any makeup. No, that's every guy thinks when a girl does a natural look that that's just no makeup at all. Dude, it's still makeup. <laughs> it's just not a full face of foundation, but it's still makeup. No, what I mean is that I'm just gonna do the bare minimum mm -hmm. to make myself look alive. Mm -hmm. Like slap this highlighter on. Highlighter. Maybe a little bit of blush, cause that, I'm that's pale. What I, mean. I, I mean, need some color on my cheeks. I'm not gonna OD. <laughs> How would you think I'm not wearing makeup? Yeah, no, girl. Have you seen these dark under eye circles? I cover that up when I go out. I don't wanna look like the corpse bride. <laughs> I know it's Halloween, I'm not dressing up every day. Look what I found in my Halloween candy. Press oh, seriously, snap. a whole McDonald's. Stay safe, y'all. Really? I know there's some stories where there's some sick people that try to hide, you know, like razor blades and candy, like the candy man, but some people just lie. They just like being part of it. <laughs> you ain't gonna find a whole McDonald's in your Kit Kat. Calm down. But anyways, that's it for funny TikToks. Comment below which one was your favorite. <laughs> As always, follow me on social media, like and share the video, subscribe, turn on notifications, and yeah, I'll see you tomorrow.